Hi, I am Joy and there's always joy in cooking. Today, we will make something special again and that is cream cheese brownies. I will use this, no? given by Linda, Cora and Pia. Thank you. Uh, this is the chewy fudge. So it's very easy to prepare. So I will need one cup of this. One, three tablespoons of this one of water, two whole eggs, and one half cup oil. No, so the first thing is, of course, I have to open this one. This has not been opened. Hi, fresh from Chicago. And then, fresh from Chicago. Thank you guys, you're so thoughtful and very supportive. So I'll just dump the entire package in this bowl. Okay. This is uh, easy to prepare. By the way, there are lots of um, pre-mixed brownies preparation that is sold in our stores. So we I just uh, combine everything. This is the wonderful thing about this is just combine and then mix, mix and and then put it in the oven. Okay. So I am ready to I am ready to mix this. I am using this one. <laughs> okay, so let me get set. Loud. But this is loud, so I am just cut. Okay, so I, I am uh, finishing this one. So I will, I will, uh, I will prepare our pan. Our pan has been prepared already. It is, it is um, 350 degrees Fahrenheit before I put in the prepared pan. My pan is 8 by 8 inch square, or this is called brownies pan. I lined it with wax paper. It has to be lined with wax paper so that you can release everything quickly. I cannot remove Cut. I have completely mixed the butter. So I will reserve one half cup. One, I will reserve one half cup of this mixture in order for it to um, to look like marble later okay so here is my pan i have prepared the pan already i cut on side on this side and then the extra paper i cut it also so i'm pouring it here After this, I will prepare the cream cheese layer. So for cream cheese layer, I will need two cups of cream cheese, two eggs, one half cup sugar. So the, the cream cheese should be completely softened if it is that softened it will be hard to mix there will be lumps so we want to avoid that okay so here we are so we set this aside and then prepare our cream cheese filling this cream cheese filling as I said is um, has been taken out of the refrigerator for about one hour already and then, and then it has to be softened but it is not really that soft uh, so okay so I need to beat this very well I need to beat this very well so that it will come out with something creamy so I will, um, I will use again this one. Oh. 
I will again use our mixer. It's a very handy mixer. Okay. And then I will just combine the eggs. I'll just combine the eggs and the sugar here. Uh, because I will be turning off the camera because this is so noisy. Our cheesecake brownies is already done. Hamot, but it has to cool in the rack before removing from the pan. So we have to wait for 15 minutes or 20 minutes depending upon um, whether it is uh, cool already. Uh, I am so excited. Okay. It has been cooled completely. So we waited for 15 minutes for this to be cooled. So we will remove it now. Oh. shall we do <laughs> with invert this here I, I want to put this in the pan but uh, cheesecake uh, so this is cream cheesecake brownies so here enjoy uh, so humble. make one too goodbye